Ever wondered what it takes for a mountain to literally blow its top? We see these epic fiery explosions in movies, but what's really going on beneath the surface? Today, we're diving deep into the explosive world of volcanoes. So how does a volcano erupt? Picture this. Deep within the earth, it's incredibly hot. So hot that rock melts into a thick flowing substance called magma. Now, this magma is less dense than the solid rock around it, so it starts to rise kind of like a hot air balloon. As it gets closer to the surface, it collects in a big underground pool called a magma chamber. But here's the kicker. This magma isn't just molten rock. It's also full of dissolved gases, like water vapor and carbon dioxide. Think of it like a bottle of soda. When the bottle is closed, the bubbles are trapped inside. But if you shake it up and pop the cap, boom. That's exactly what happens with a volcano. As the magma rises, the pressure drops, and those trapped gases start to form bubbles. These bubbles expand and expand and expand until the pressure becomes so immense that it violently blasts the magma and rock out of the ground. And that, my friends, is a volcanic eruption. From gentle lava flows to catastrophic explosions that can shoot ash miles into the sky. Now for a bit of volcanic trivia. Which country do you think is the world's volcanic hotspot? If you guessed Indonesia, you'd be close, but the champion is actually the United States. That's right. The U.S. has 161 active volcanoes, most of them located in Alaska's Aleutian Islands, a chain of volcanic islands forming a massive arc. Indonesia comes in a very close second, but the U.S. just edges it out. But what about the biggest volcano? We're not talking about the tallest, but the largest in terms of sheer volume and area. For that, we have to look to the stars. Well, almost. It's Mauna Loa in Hawaii. This absolute giant rises more than 13,000 feet above sea level. But here's the mind-blowing part. Its base is deep on the ocean floor. If you measure it from its true base, it's over 30,000 feet tall, making it taller than Mount Everest. It's so massive and heavy that it has literally pressed down the sea floor beneath it. So, from the fiery mechanics deep within our planet to the colossal giants that shape our world, volcanoes are a powerful and awe-inspiring force of nature. They are both creators and destroyers, a constant reminder of the dynamic living planet beneath. Please like and subscribe for my channel.